Hey everyone, welcome back to Essence Awaken on my TikTok. My apologies. I noticed when I was away, I was like, oh my goodness, I didn't do Capricorn or Aquarius or Pisces. So I'm doing those right now. I am so sorry, you guys. My apologies. So go ahead, let me go ahead and jump right into it. And this is going to be for my Capricorns, okay? We have Fate. This is a destined partnership. Now that was kind of up in reverse, but this is an overall energy. So that was in reverse. So I really feel like with that energy in reverse, that you feel like this this partnership that you're in with someone, that is not a destined partnership. I feel like you feel like this is a false partnership I'm hearing. But I'm hearing like patience, everything will unfold in divine timing. So something that you've been asking for or wanting to know that's gonna unfold. You just have to be patient, okay? Divine timing is at play right now, okay? We have um, we have addiction. So with with you being in a relationship with this person, um, there could have been a lot of addiction involved. I'm hearing male, they're saying male or female, okay? And you was probably with like you was probably you probably been in denial, and so they're telling you that you need to detach from the situation, okay? To clearly see and understand what this relationship is, okay? Because there was there's a lot there was a lot of financial difficulties with this uh, this partnership that affected the the partnership as well. Or this when you got with this person they they told you that they was that they had a lot of money and they didn't, um, or they could be able to do this and that. And the same and you also think about does this does this um. Does this situation align with your integrity? Like, I really think, I, I really feel like you're going into comp, uh, comp, uh, consp, what is it called? Like, you're going into hermit mode. Consp, uh, I can't pronounce it. Why can I say this word? But you're going inward to understand what's going on. See, they're wanting you to retreat, okay? And recharge your batteries to really see. Yeah, they want you to go slow. That there was a lot of interference with a third party situation that is indulging in your relationship. This could have been with someone that that is your your destined partner. Okay. So you needed to go like I really feel like because the same that you needed that you need to retreat retreat and take time alone to understand this partnership to understand it. Okay, I really feel like this was something that you need. This was like, I'm hearing a lesson learned for you and that you needed to go slow and go inward. Okay. Or you feel like you should have got to, you should have tipped things. All right, Capricorn. So this is part two. Um, I really feel like this is kind of like a long reading, but we left on with um retreat that you need to go inward recharge your batteries to help to understand like what's going on because i really feel like the situation that you were in there was a like you had a lot of denial you need to go like to get go inward there was some type of patience that you're needing to to have right now because everything happens in divine timing um you know the spirit was also stating about, you know, you going slow. You should have took more time to go slow and understand this connection with this person that you've been dealing with, okay? Yeah, self-care, clear clear your energy field and focus on yourself. So I feel like that's, that what came out in reverse. Something about that you was not you. You need to clear your energy to understand exactly what's going on. Like, they just, what I'm hearing it is... My words are just so scrambled up that it's so much that they want to say to you, Capricorn, that you need to go inward to understand exactly what's going on. Because it was like retreat and denial, interference with your true love. I don't I, I feel like this was a lesson that you needed to learn. We have true love. This this love is emotional, physical, and unconditional. I really that goes to like the person that you're supposed to be with because we have interference. So I feel like this this person, external party, is the one that you're with that you're needing to distance yourself with because your true love is the person that you're supposed to be with that got into this, that was interfering with your true love, the person that you're supposed to be with. We have chemistry, attraction, 
you feel is mutual. That's in reverse. I feel like there's no more attraction that you have for this person. Give me two more cards for Capricorn. Yeah, vulnerability. I really feel like you could have been, that you felt like you could have been vulnerable with this person. But with you being vulnerable with this person, I think, I feel like they, they took advantage of it. I really feel like he was obsessed in a certain way with this person, but you're not anymore. Or they could have been obsessed with you in the connection. Anything else? And we have boundaries. Yeah, you need to have firm boundaries when um, taking retreat and taking your distance from this person. Give me some more information for Capricorn before I close out. Yeah, ask your angels. You need to pray. Ask your angels. Ask, you know, the divine of exactly what you need to do. Within, within the next few weeks, something major is going to happen for you. Not major, but it's going to be a stepping stone to something major. We have, you know, like, yeah, definitely. You need to keep going boundaries with this person. One more card. One second. So the last two cards for Capricorn, 